Hey guys, and welcome back to Tales of Eternia. In the last part, I teased you once again by telling you that we're going to be getting Max's ultimate skill, and then I ended it off here in Ginny, the City of Joy, which is not all that joyful, apparently, because there's nobody here and we can't go anywhere. Um, who are you? Unbelievable! I traveled all this way to... to wait. I traveled all this way only to come to this boring, empty town. Yeah, me too. Seriously, I went over the... O I went through the seafloor to get here. There better be something... There should be something good here. All right, well, welcome. A siesta will be five Ginny. Okay, uh, would you like a room? Sure. Why not? What could possibly go wrong? I'm sure nothing untoward will happen. Please enjoy Ginny's nightlife to your heart's content. The nightlife? What nightlife? There's nobody here. Oh, yes, there is. When you lose all your money, you lose everything. Your status, your self-confidence, even love. <laughs> okay, whatever. Oh, I like this place already. Now, ooh, casino, 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 casino. What's this? A wonder chef in front of the freaking thing? What? I am the mysterious wonder chef. I'll show you how to make hot pot, the perfect cure for gambling fatigue. Dinner and you ha hot pot. Awesome. Hot pot has four ingredients: eggs, conia, rash, and red satay. All right. Have a nice day. You bet I will. So cool. Is that, is that Elvis? Is there Elvis at the card table? Whatever, anyway. Right here, you can exchange gold for Jenny here. What would you like to do? Check, um, find out the exchange rate. All right, 104 gold per Jenny. Huh, okay. Let's go ahead and exchange. Uh, exchange money. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and get, um, 20 Jenny. I'm gonna go ahead and spend a little bit of money and just get some Jenny. Because, oh, no, I don't want, uh, Okay, it's very, very important that you actually build up some money here because that first 10 Ginny, if you spend all of that on accident on two siestas and you don't buy any here, you can't get any more and you're screwed out of the rest of the city. So be sure you pick up a bunch. I mean, you're not really going to be spending it on much, but just in case, just buy some, just to be on the safe side. Okay, so... Throughout history, all the rulers of Celestias were known to be master whiz players. Oh, so they're playing whiz? Cool. I, I play, but last time I played there, I got raped, so I'm not even going to try. I won't waste your time, because we got crap to do. Okay. Um, who are you? What do you got to say? Why should I work when all I have to do is make money to go to the casino? Or Wait, I haven't heard the... Uh, no. Colleen's pot had a mysterious power. Okay, whatever. I don't know who that is. Hey, look who it is. Lysidia, are you still traveling the world? The Nightscape of Ginny completed my sketchbook. You finished? So what are you going to do with your sketchbook now? I can finally make my offering to the sea where my childhood friend rests in peace. And then I will return home to my husband. To the man I've loved from the moment I first met him. It was a long detour, but now we can finally begin our life as husband and wife. If you ever run into the Shaleska leader, could you give this to him and tell him that his long-lost wife will soon be home? What? what? Wait. <laughs> He's so distraught. Re-received the Canceller. I don't even know what the frick this thing does, but apparently it's valuable. Anyway, <laughs> I gotta do this, the dance hall. I need to practice so I don't get dizzy. Okay, have fun with it. Good luck with that. I am what they call a big shot producer. <gasps> George Lucas! Can I kill you, please? No, just kidding. Okay, what's up? Welcome to the dance hall. You look full of energy, miss. Care to take in the partake in the dance off? You mean Meredy? Uh, yeah, you're dancing. Um, Meredy, not sure. The charge is three Jenny for one person, five Jenny for a couple. Uh, whoa. Um, we'll do it as a couple, because that'll be funnier. Reed, dance off. Let's try hurry. I mean, uh, wait, let's try. Let's try. I thought you were the one who were unsure. All right, all right, we'll do it. We enter as couple. So I'm going, me and Meredy as a couple. We're dancing together. Aw, whatever. Don't expect too much from me. Silly Reed, Meredy, no, you'll do great. Aw, thanks. Okay, no, I'm just kidding. Well, I, you know, I'm voicing Reed with my normal voice, so it's kind of like Reed is me. 
Keep your character under the spotlight. Points are deducted every time your character steps out of the spotlight. I suck at this. I'm just letting you know, I've never won this. So you move the characters with the D-pads. So yeah. Okay, let me concentrate. I gotta concentrate here. Oh no. Wait, wait, what? How do you move Reed? Crap! How do you move Reed? I don't know! I can't move him. Oh, maybe I'm not supposed to move Reed. I don't know. I probably am, but... Oh, I'm, I'm supposed to move Reed! Jeez, these are so hard to work with. I'm supposed to move Reed, but I don't know how. I'm using both control sticks. Oh, wait, no! It's a two... It's two-player! My bad. I need to do it with just Merity. That way I can concentrate. My bad. Herp-a-derp! I'm such a moron. <laughs> I told you I can't dance. I have two left feet. Merity bad, too. Oh, no, you weren't. Okay, here. Let's try it again. It's just Merity. I'll last longer that way. Okay. Yeah, yeah. You mean Merity? Yes, you're unsure, even though you just did it. Okay, one. Okay, solo challenger. Okay, Merity try. Please proceed to the stage inside. All right. Let's do it. Break a leg. We'll be watching from the audience. You bet. Okay, let's do it. Let's watch our woman dance for... Okay, sorry. <laughs> I'm terrible. Okay. Yeah, yeah. All right, I still suck at this really bad, but I'm gonna try again because I wanted it's fun because I love seeing Merity dance. It's it's cute. Okay, maybe I'll be a bit better too. It's so difficult when they start splitting up like this because you don't know which one to stay with. Jeez. On. And the music is really good, too. I like it. Hey, I'm actually doing kind of good, sort of. I don't know. No, no, stop it. Stop, stop, stop moving so fast. I can't keep up. Oh, my God. So hard to keep up. So hard. Okay. No, no. I had it. Okay. I still have it. No, what are you doing? Quit it. Oh, I mistaked. Apparently, I mistaked. I didn't fail. I just mistaked. <laughs> oh, well. Whatever. I tried. Don't feel bad. You can try again another time. You bet. All right. That's a <laughs> Actually, no, you can't because I'm never trying it again because I'll just fail again. Okay. So, um, now that we've seen Lysidia, we can co... Or we can co... We're going to go back to Tinsia, pick up Max, and come... I didn't mean to do that. I really seriously did not mean to do that. <sighs> Why were the eye fish there? Uh, go back. You know, I'll, I'll see you back there. Because we're going to go get Max and we're just going to come right back. So I'll see you there. Okay, we're right here back in Ginny, the City of Joy. I don't really need to say the title again, but whatever. Anyway, we're back here with Max. So... We need to go ahead and do another, have another siesta. And, uh, well, actually, you know that five Ginny, or no, 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 you don't get five, you get ten. That first ten Ginny that you get in the city, like the second that you walk in, if you're only going to do this and you know exactly how much you need to spend, you're not going to have any trouble with this. So, just, just in case you want to come back here again, you want to get more money. But anyway, look, Max, it's the Career Fortune Pink Miacus. Yes, it is. Yeah, I'm not letting it get away this time. Hey, you caught it. Wow. Bye bye, it likes us. No shock. <laughs> that's because it's finally feel uh, that's because it finally feels my love. Come to think of it, a woman we met here asked us to take a message to the leader of Shaleska. Yeah. Hey, Keel. How you doing? Still a douche? Yep. Courier of Fortune, Miacus, is just a superstition. As there are differences in the hair color among people, the density of pigments contained in animal fur affect... <laughs> Whoa! It, it disappeared? Wheel! 
Pink Miacus is not superstition. It is is true god of fortune. Wow. Okay then, the god of fortune, huh? Yeah, is that so? <laughs> Max learned elemental master. The most powerful freaking skill in the game. It makes Aurora's sword looks like a children's toy. I'm dead serious. It seriously does. <laughs> it is the best freaking skill in the whole game. It breaks the game if you have him use it multiple times. Seriously. Like, at one point, when, like in my practice file, there was a point at which I was grinding for a long time. Basically, I could defeat an entire encounter with one use of that skill. I'm dead serious. It's that freaking powerful. But anyway, now that we're done with Max's skills, it's time to finish off Chats, because she just has one final skill left to get. As you can see, she's got five. And just like Max, she can get a total of six. So we're gonna be getting her her sixth now. Yeah, what's up? This is terrible! What is? What is it? What? Mind letting us in on the little joke here? Yes, it's a tree. It's very nice. What's wrong? Someone switched the monument with a fake. Blah, 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 blah. 128, or 120, 128. It's true, the numbers are different from before. Okay, well, we'll go there. It must get the real one back. It is an irre irreplaceable monument left by my great-grandfather. All right. If 120, 128 is our clue, then this doesn't appear to be the work of an ordinary thief. Is somebody deliberately challenging me? Descendants of the great pirate Eifried? Uh, yes. If we use GPS, we can go to that location. Yeah, we know. Let's get going right away. Yeah, yeah. All right. What's the problem? Let's get going. Uh, no problem. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> anyway... This is a pretty easy skill to get. X. Really? Really? I've half a mind to bring Max in here to just destroy your entire world. What the frick are they shooting? <laughs> they shoot like little blue energy beams out of their mouths. It's kind of cool, actually. All right, so 120, 128. If I remember, it's like right over here. Um. Yeah, it's like right over here. See, I'm all, I'm on top of it right now. So, you know, let's just land here. Just walk right in the forest. So, um, wait, that's it. Uh, hello? What the? Stop. Okay, wait. I gotta get this facing north so I can get the directions right. Okay, 120, 128. There it is, finally. Jeez. So walk around the woods for a little bit and you'll find it. I found it! I found it. <laughs> it's the monument left on the blah, 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 blah. Yes, even the inscribed numbers match. Okay. I wonder what this is. What is it? Is it something? It's Pico Revenge. It's one of the seven fundamental pirate tools. And tyrant pools. This is the only one that I don't have yet. My great grandfather has shown us the light. Okay, whatever. Yippee. Found Pico Revenge. I believe that's... Is that another skill for her? Really? Huh. Wait, what? I thought this was... That, that's not the skill that she's supposed to get. Is that a skill? Oh, no, no. It's an item. Right. Okay. Here. I'm going to go ahead and give her that instead of the Emerald Ring. Okay, Pico Revenge. Where is it? Uh, there it is. Pico Revenge. A POW hammer will randomly appear when you receive damage. Very nice. Um, that is, uh, a Pico is short for Pico Han, which is actually the Japanese version of Pow Hammer. So, yeah, like, have you ever, oh, whatever, oh, I know too much about these games. Okay, anyway, after you do that, you want to head in back to Chat's Hut, and you want to actually go inside. Now, you want to go ahead and go down here, and go ahead and talk to the book. Oh, we'll just come down here, I guess. What is it? Is everything in this house from the Eifried era? Yes, most of it anyway. The year is written on the barrel. 
SE2208. SE2208 in Celestian years? So how many years ago would that be? Huh? Let's see. It's SE2296 this year, so... <laughs> she can't do math. Hold on a minute. Um, do you have a piece of paper? If it's SE... If it, if it, it must be eight year, 88 years ago. Can't you do the calculation in your head? You better study more math. I couldn't. Please, you sound like my mother. That's interesting. I haven't heard you talk about your mother. Hey, hey, Meredith found this paper stuck in the back. Oh, really? What does it say? Is it... Is it interesting? What does it say? Do you have what it takes to be a great pirate? Take my challenge and test your worthiness. Those who manage to clear my obstacles will earn their just reward. A challenge? From who? Eifried, who else? The only one... Isn't that obvious? It's my great-grandfather, the great pirate Eifried. Yeah, yeah. Go to Eifried's hideout. All right, you must mean the hideout. Yes, it's the 20408 one. All right, we must go. Oh, I'm getting tired of reading dialogue. Jeez, so much. All right, so what we need to do now is just head to Eifried's hideout. So that's not too bad, right? Right? No, no, there's, no, there's nothing in between here. There's no, like, danger in between. So, no worries. Akuna Matata! Anyway. <laughs> uh, I can't believe I just referenced that. Got nothing against it, I just think it's kind of... It's a very odd thing to reference on a freaking Let's Play, but whatever. Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and get in the Van Eltia again, because I believe we need to get there from the water. Can I please land? There we go. Okay, so, now that we are back in the Van Eltia, and we're coming up on 20 minutes here, we're gonna end it off. And in the next part, okay. And in the next part, we're gonna head to Eifried's hideout, which, you know, I'll just get there now. I'll go in and stuff. Well, actually, no, I won't go in, because I might be a cutscene there or something. But anyway, in the next part, We'll go into Eifried's hideout to see what he has in store for us. Okay, see you guys later.